This morning, law enforcement all over Central Florida were busy watching busy intersections as part of a crosswalk crackdown. Police spent the morning looking for drivers who don't stop for pedestrians. Channel 9's Q McRae was at one intersection where officers gave out 18 citations. Well, as you can see here behind me, the officers stayed busy today as they pulled over driver after driver that did not yield to a pedestrian in a crosswalk. Now, this is the detail here at the Apopka Island Road uh, intersection just north of Lake Street near Sand Lake Elementary School. This is all a part of the Best Foot Forward campaign. Its goal is to remind the public of the importance of following the laws that protect pedestrians as required by Florida law. Now, especially around this time of the year, studies show springing into daylight savings time brings increased dangers for pedestrians and drivers alike so right now Orange County and Osceola County law enforcement are teaming up for a two-day targeted enforcement campaign to urge drivers to use caution we spoke to one person who got pulled over today who told us she didn't know about the rules about pedestrians and cross rocks I think it's all in all good I mean obviously consequences come with bad things but it's actually a good thing to actually protect us so no bad had, uh, vibes, positive vibes here, and I'll definitely follow the, the law going forward. Now, in Orlando, at the intersection of North Bumby and Virginia Drive, pedestrians told us they're also concerned about their safety, especially because people seem to speed through that area. Here's what one of them had to say. I see it all the time, like very close calls. Thankfully, they're close calls, but if you just focus. According to Best Foot Forward, Law enforcement here in Orange County and in Osceola County will be keeping an eye on 18 intersections today and tomorrow. The fine for breaking the law? Well, at least $164 plus three points off your license. In Orange County, Q McRae, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.